this video, we will look at encrypting virtual machines, which is a new feature available in VMware Workstation 9. To encrypt a virtual machine, power off the virtual machine, select the virtual machine and click on VM, and Settings. On the Options tab, select Access Control, click Encrypt. Type the encryption password and click Encrypt. It is important that you make sure to record the encryption password you use. If you forget the password, Workstation does not provide a way to retrieve it. Depending on the size of the virtual machine, the encryption process can take several minutes or several hours. Click OK. To remove encryption from a virtual machine, power off the virtual machine Remove any sensitive information from the virtual machine, select the virtual machine and click on VM, and Settings. In the Options tab, select Access Control. Please note, to remove encryption, you will have to make sure that you have disabled restrictions. Under Encryption, click Remove Encryption, type the encryption password, and click Remove Encryption. You can change the password for an encrypted virtual machine. Changing the password does not re-encrypt the virtual machine. When you use this feature to change the password, the master key used to decrypt the virtual machine is not changed and the virtual machine is not re-encrypted. For security reasons, instead of changing the password by using this procedure, you might choose to remove encryption and then encrypt the virtual machine again with a different password. To change the password for an encrypted virtual machine, power off the virtual machine, select the virtual machine and click VM, and Settings. In the Options tab, select Access Control, under Encryption, select Change Password. Type the current password and the new password. It is important that you make sure to record the new password. If you forget the password, Workstation does not provide a way to retrieve it. This concludes our look at encrypting virtual machines in Workstation 9. For further tutorial videos, be sure to subscribe to our KBTV YouTube channel and our KBTV blog. Thank you for choosing VMware.